Your Lord, O Heavenly Father, I'm not sure what your plan was when you gave me life. What did you see when you looked at me? You saved my soul 12 years later at a little white church in the middle of nowhere. I still remember that day like it was yesterday. I heard your voice so clearly. Since that day, there have been many times of joy and times where I sat in awe of what you were doing in my life or in the lives of those around me. But there were also many times I was so broken. My insecurities and doubt took over and I could no longer see your goodness. I was consumed by hurt and couldn't feel your presence. I lost my faith. I lost my way. I didn't think I'd ever get out of the hole I was in. I never thought I'd find my way back to you. I was in so deep. I no longer believed you had a plan for my life, but that's just what Satan wanted. But then you came along right on time and you pulled me through. You reminded me what it was like to stay on top of the mountain again. I could finally see your working hand. I don't think I would have made it through the storm without you. I don't know how or why you have continued to use me. You put all of my broken pieces back together and made something beautiful. You had a plan through it all. It's only because of you, God, that I've made it safe thus far. You deserve all the praise, and I can never thank you enough. As I get to share my testimony with the world of how you brought me through, I hope and pray that they see you in me. You are my everything. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Well, that was the testimony of local author Brian Williams. Now, earlier in the show, we presented 16 unique and low-cost or perhaps even free Christmas gift ideas. We've got a bonus number 17 for you. Give the gift of reading material from a local author like Brian Williams, as his book can be found at Gifts of Joy, Barnes & Noble at UNOH, or online at Amazon.com and BarnesandNoble.com, as well as BooksAmillion.com. There are many local authors with quality books, and Jennifer has just a few of those. That's right. Here is Brian Williams' book right here. But so many other local authors, talented individuals that are writing. Kathy Burris wrote Lovely Traces of Hope. Dr. L.T. McGray with 100. Kim Lyons with 21 Days of Prayer Impact. Just a few of the many books. Coming up later this month, we'll bring you another author testimony. Veronica Fox shares why she titled her recent book, Thank You God for Not Answering My Prayer. <laughs> 